Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Eric Barfell and I wanted to give you guys a tour of my pain cave, show you my entire uh, bike, my uh, Zwift setup, the whole nine yards. If you remember from a while ago, I said I bought a house and we're all moved in and everything and the pain cave is set up pretty good, good enough to actually like portray and show you guys. So I want to give you a quick tour of that and then I also want to show you another sweet room that I think is like in this house. All right, so here we have it. We got two halves of the room. Uh, it's more so my wife's half. She got um, the whole weight set up, uh, some yoga mats, ab wheel, a little dog that's really cute. Her name's Kershaw. Hi, Kershaw. Uh, sweet mirror. What's up? And then on this half, it's kind of more so my side. Also comes with a, a dog. Um, this is my old bike, my uh, Trek 1.2, 2.1, whatever it is, aluminum. Great commuting bike, uh, I ride to work sometimes when it's nice. Dude, this is my giant TCR, full carbon setup. I'll uh, break that down here in a second. And then uh, this is the whole Zwifting setup that I got. I just use my MacBook Pro, got a fan, got a webcam of sorts, plugs in. And uh, yeah, dude, we just pedal our brains out right here. This is my giant TCR, SLR, whatever, whatever. Uh, bought it on Craigslist a couple years ago. Dude, I paid $2,500 somewhere in there for this bike. Brand new, it's like $5,500, $6,000. Came with um, these carbon wheels. They're the giant SLR wheels. It's a full Altegra build. Um, everything's got a, I put on a 54.2 chain ring up in the front. And um, other than that, Altegra, full Altegra group set. It's actually Altegra DI2. So it's got the, uh, the electric, the electronic group set, which is actually hanging out right there. Chill. I am a total bro on a budget. I hate, 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 hate paying full price for anything, especially anything in the cycling industry because it's absolutely absurd. Dude, full carbon fiber bike with Altegra DI2? not paying full price i'll get a couple years old doesn't matter to me i don't care at all it's actually a 2016 model does that mean anything to me nope it's a carbon bike dude it goes fast it's lightweight i love it and i ride it the wahoo kicker right behind me those are what twelve hundred dollars i paid seven hundred dollars for it last year how? Why? Two words for you. Certified refurbished right from their own website. So if it had like a one year warranty on it, dude, I had no issues with it. It came a little janky. I had to get like a new skewer. Boo hoo. That's $10. Who cares? Saving like hundreds of dollars. And then over here, I just run Zwift on the, on the MacBook computer. I got some rinky dink webcam thing that I got from Amazon. Dude, that's just a normal box fan. Nothing special about it. Actually, this is kind of cool. Let me, let me shut this. This this stand, I got this on his Amazon for like $30, $40, and it uh, it's screwed in pretty tight, but it does it does swivel, and then it's got this arm that moves around a bunch. Uh, I can raise and lower it on this post. Pretty sweet. So yeah, this is my this is my pain cave setup. Dude, I love it. Is it is it super high tech and and really hip and trendy looking? No, it's it's a bookshelf with a computer and a fan on it and a and a Craigslist bike but it's mine and I love it and I get excellent use out of it. Next thing I wanna show you is uh, the reflection of me vlogging right there, uh, but it's actually through this door. There's no doorknob on it, but uh, like I said, we just moved in. Check this out. I got a whole like workbench here. I got some um, extra wheels and stuff. I got some deeper section wheels. That's the other wheel uh, from the from the kicker. Um, tools and everything. So I do a lot of work right here. I sit right here. Some old trainers on the ground. Some wheels from some other bike build that I, uh, you know, still have to put together and everything. That's really old. All the gels and nutrition your heart could ever desire. I got boxes of them. I got bags of them. Dude, whatever you want, I got it. Some... Uh, the hydration stuff there helmet all kinds of sunglasses some other tools but that's all like my outdoor stuff really some old saddles up here i got all these like random pieces and parts um tires shirts saddle bags cleaning gear whatever else over here dude all kinds of hydration these are more so the wife she got the celsius whatever those are pedialyte dude if you're not drinking pedialyte you're missing out all the Gatorade, Powerade, BioSteel. Again, I don't pay full price for anything. Look at this, 39 cents from uh, from this like scratch and dent store. Got all kinds of stuff for mega cheap. My wife loves whatever those are. Uh, protein bars, things like that up here. All kinds of goodies, 
Kershaw loves it. So this is like my whole, like sometimes I'll work on bikes and stuff. I'll, uh, you know, just mess around. Sometimes I'll sit right here and just edit videos too. So that's it, man. That's my pain cave. Again, is it super fancy, super high tech? Absolutely not, but it's mine and I get excellent use out of it. And I didn't pay full price for a single thing. So I hope you enjoyed. Hey, if you have any budget saving uh, cycling tips that your boy needs to know about, it's going to save me money, get me good stuff. Drop it in the comments down below. I love that kind of stuff. I hope you were able to benefit from this because, dude, at the end of the day, it's your stuff. As long as you use it and you enjoy it, nothing wrong with it. Hey, thanks, guys, for watching. I'll see you in the next one.